Today on All About Cards, we're doing a speed break of 2012 Topps Baseball Series 1. This box contains 36 packs with 10 cards per pack and the promise of one autograph or one relic card per box. The 330 base card set is paralleled in Golden Moments, Short Print Variations, Black Border, Platinum, Wood, and Printing Plates. Inserts include Silk Collection, 1987 Topps Minis, World Series Pin Cards, Retired Rings, Golden Coins, Prime 9 Redemptions, Sketch Card Redemptions, Topps Golden Giveaway Codes, In the Name Jumbo Relics, Gold Standard, World Series Champions, Golden Moments, Classic Walk-Offs, Golden Greats, Timeless Talents, Golden Futures, 1967 Mickey Mantle Reprint Relics, Golden Moment Cut Signatures, Solid Golden Greats, and Golden Tickets Good for a Golden Fused Major League Baseball autographed by Hank Aaron, Willie Mays, and Ken Griffey Jr. Now let's get to the break. And this is the flagship series for Tops, Tops Baseball Series 1, 2012. This is a speed break, and we're going to show you every card that we got in this hobby box. If there's a card you want to take a closer look at, simply pause the video and check it out for as long as you want. And then come on back, and you'll see every other card. Here's our first uh, big hit. That was a Reed Johnson card, a black border, numbered to 61. So there are some similarities between last year's edition, and if you haven't figured it out uh, from uh, the intro, this year's edition is gold-themed. You've got your Timeless Classics that's uh, like the duos, but I like them a lot better this year um, because they've got bigger photos, more close-ups uh, of the players, so I appreciate that. Um, the gold cards, the golden moment cards, which are look like gold, are um, parallels for the uh, diamond cards last year. I've got to say I like the diamond cards a little bit better. The gold cards just came off a little muddy to me. And I've seen scans of the, uh, the silk collection. Uh, sort of felt the same thing, too. Uh, you've got the golden giveaway this year. There's a code card. And that's a little bit different from last year's diamond giveaway. Um, before, with baseball, you were digging for cards and entering the codes uh, to get uh, every single card that Topps had produced um, in the past. And this year, uh, the only cards that are available online for the Golden Giveaway are the die cuts, which were very popular and um, work out just as well, honestly. Uh, it was nice to get uh, all those cards, but uh, in truth... I'd prefer the die cuts myself. So you've got your golden moments, you've got your golden greats, which the golden greats I really like the look of, and here's um, Prime 9 Redemption. Uh, this year's theme for Prime 9 is Home Run Legends. So far they've uh, announced the first three, which were Hank Aaron, Willie Mays and Babe Ruth and we'll be announcing all the Prime 9 Redemption so make sure you check out our blog to keep up to date. Here's our hit for the box a um, Carlos Pena relic card Golden Moments new this year Topps has secured some legends of the game like here the Roberto Clemente um, they've also got uh, Joe DiMaggio that they secured for this. And um, for autographs, brand new Willie Mays, which is very cool, and Ken Griffey Jr. And as we said in the intro, um, both of those autographs can be found along with Hank Aaron. If you're one of the lucky people to pull a golden ticket, and you'll get a golden fused Major League Baseball with all three autographs, which is outstanding. It's a lot of added bonuses this year for uh, Tops. 
they've sort of gotten out of their way to uh, add value to the to the product and that's great if you're one of the lucky ones to be able to pull any of those you've got golden fused cards um, so there's a lot to offer this year so all in all another solid offering from tops flagship uh, series um, if you're collecting baseball cards this is a no-brainer this should uh, always be a part of your collection every year it's a great record uh, of the year and um, they've done a nice job with the cards this year so that should just about do it for this box of series one we'll be covering series two and update and a lot of other boxes so make sure you check those out to see a review of Topps Baseball Series 1 and pictures of the cards we pulled, make sure you check out our blog and our Facebook page, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.